making some great choices in maternity wear. Always classy, always flattering. Kim Kardashian is also making some choices. Some good, some not great, but she is really trying. And if you're pregnant, you know there are some really lovely outfits out there. Stylist B.C. Adeshina is here with some beautiful fashions for moms-to-be. Good to have you here, B.C. Thank you. It's great to be here. There's no excuse for a pregnant woman not to look amazing. I totally agree because everyone wants to look her best, and that's no exception even when they're pregnant. So today we have some fun looks, and I'm going to talk about some tips to help you pick out clothing that's very proportionate but also fun and will help you avoid avoid looking frumpy. Nobody wants to be frumpy. Okay, let's bring out our first model. This is Alex. Tell us about what Alex is wearing. Well, the trends right now are bright colors mixed together. And what we have here today, speaking of proportion, is if you want to wear something big on top, it's always better to have something more fitted on the bottom, like a pencil skirt mm -hmm. or these skinny jeans. See, now, when you say the word skinny jeans and pregnant woman just doesn't go together, but this are these jeans comfortable? They are very comfortable. They have some stretch, so they give. Mm -hmm. And they also have the little secret tummy so that it stretches during the whole process of the pregnancy. See how maternity jeans have come a long way? They've come a very long way there's so many different styles and if you're not daring enough to wear color uh -huh. just opt for a dark denim which every woman should have in their wardrobe anyway right and that's always good to do a little layering obviously. and a little layering is great if you want to go to the office or you're just a little chilly a cute little blazer like this one by theory is just awesome and if you want to take it off or leave it on you have that option and this nice little belt with the umpire waist which mm -hmm. is such a friend to a pregnancy a process is just so flattering for the belly i love the little belt it's a, such a cute accent I love this. And you know what the greatest thing is? After she has her baby, she can still wear the outfit. She can still wear the outfit. And the jeans, too. Oh, she's rocking it. <laughs> Thank you, Allie. All right, our next model is Kristen. She's, got, she's pregnant with her first child. Oh, she looks so cute. Big florals are a big trend this spring also. I love this dress by Donna Morgan. I love the side tie, which gives a little bit of a ruching effect around the tummy. Mm -hmm. And it just makes it look a little more flattering, a little, a little cute. And she's smaller in frame, so you want to be careful when you're petite. You want to wear clothes that are very fitted to your body, or else if it's a little bigger, you're good. you're gonna look more frumpy. Right, and you want to make sure your your length of your skirt goes just above, above the, knee. the knee. Exactly, and wearing heels like these wedges here also elongate the body. Right, and with wedges, it's not so hard to walk. Exactly, you want to think comfort, definitely. Super cute, I want that dress myself. Isn't it great? Very and nice. again, this is something else she could wear after the pregnancy. Definitely. Thank you. All right, our next model is Juliana. Hi, Juliana. Hi, she's I love this. This going to be your third? Yeah, third baby. Oh, wow. I know she has her hands full. Uh -huh. one, one alone. Um, so, now this is the reverse of the proportion aspect of dressing. When you're wearing something fitted on the top, then you can go for something more voluminous on the bottom, like this one. Because, again, what you want to avoid is wearing something big on top and on the bottom, yeah. or you just look like a big mop. You don't want to wear a tent. You don't no. want to wear a tent. No. And don't be afraid of stripes. This is isn't your traditional horizontal stripe because it's more of a chevron it's more forgiving and it gives you less of a widening effect okay let's bring all our uh, moms to be out one more time and these fashions all came from destination maternity very very nice and we're going to be doing some pilates and yoga with these young ladies uh, a little later on in the show can't wait to see that all right <laughs> Anna, Shana, thank you very much thanks thanks ladies. for having me here's just yeah. some great easy labors jerry over to you